I think the first time I really thought about the process of storytelling or thought about the idea that writers had tricks that they used was when I was watching a John Wayne movie with my mom. And I was very young, so I may not be remembering this entirely correctly. This has been a long time, but we were coming up on a part early in the movie where all of the children that John Wayne's character will eventually take on as the crew of uh, <laughs> for a massive cattle drive, and they're in a schoolhouse. Before John Wayne shows up, the teacher has the kids put the chalkboard up on shelves, up on books, so everyone can see it. And so then John Wayne comes in and tells the kids about the job, and the smallest boy asks if he can come too. And John Wayne draws a line on the chalkboard and says, you know, sorry kid, you gotta be this tall to ride this ride, essentially. And so um, after John Wayne leaves, the kids take down the books and then the kid is tall enough to go because before he was clearly too short. Uh, so then he's tall enough to go. And my mom pointed out that we as the audience knew something that John Wayne's character didn't, that um, the chalkboard was up on books, and that later that paid off when they took the books down and then the kid was tall enough. So that was really the first time that I had thought about writers using tools. And I don't know how it came up because I don't think I would have been more than seven or eight and I already like stories, but I was young, so I didn't quite understand what went into making a story. I knew that I wanted to make them uh, either written down or a performance or a story told aloud, but my stories were never as interesting as I wanted them to be, and I couldn't figure out why. So when she told me this, it made me realize that there were things that storytellers did to make stories good, that there was a method to it. There was a method to storytelling, that there were tools that you could use, but in a more kid logic kind of way. And it was when I realized that writers had a plan. It felt like such a discovery <laughs> to a little kid. And I still feel the same way when I figure out some new part of a story and or new part of writing and how I can actually use it. And uh, I'm 31 now, and that memory still sits at the back of my mind. I think about it a lot, about setups and payoffs and foreshadowing and just anything writers use to tell stories. So thanks for splitting my mind open, Mom. It ignited a passion that's been burning for a very long time. And watch the Cowboys. I guess. <laughs> I don't know if I've seen it since I was like 14, but yeah, check it out. Thanks.